What's good? I'm Sean DePaz, aka Mac ETN's Loogie, and this is the PHNX Sports Report. So, if you don't know what today's AKA is referencing, last night, UCLA's Mac ETN, a redshirt freshman forward, was arrested and cited for assault after spitting at U of A fans following last night's game. Of course, ETN, who didn't even play in the game, was upset because the Wildcats handed the Bruins just their third loss of the season, winning 76 to 66. Sadly, or maybe thankfully, for ASU men's basketball, they failed to give anyone a reason to spit at the 9-4-2 crew because the Sun Devils lost a heartbreaker to the number 19 ranked USC Trojans. Despite leading for most of the second half and a career-high 19-point performance from Jalen Graham, ASU's offense failed to get buckets when it needed to and fell just short of the upset, losing 58-53. to Sadly, the Sun Devils weren't the only Valley basketball team to lose last night, as the Phoenix Suns suffered a rare defeat as well. The Suns fell to the Atlanta Hawks 124-115, despite a quiet 32-point performance from D-Book and 24 from Mikael Bridges. Unfortunately, that wasn't o- enough to overcome a Hawks team that shot nearly 50% from behind the arc and saw Trey Young put up a whopping 43 points. On the bright side for Suns fans, Booker and backcourt partner Chris Paul, in what seemed like a foregone conclusion, were officially named Western Conference All-Stars just before the game and would join the Suns coaching staff in Cleveland. Speaking of All-Stars, the NHL All-Star Game and Skills Competition is this weekend and will feature just one Arizona Coyote, Clayton Keller. In addition to representing the Central Division during the game, Keller will also take part in the Accuracy Competition tonight. And because they are, well, the best, DraftKings will actually let you bet on Keller to win the Accuracy Contest, listing him as the long shot with plus 1,000 odds to win. If you think he can pull off the upset over the likes of Leon Dreisaitl or Johnny Goudreau, then make sure to download America's top-rated sportsbook app and place those bets. Don't forget to use code PHNX at sign up to receive your free bets. Last, but certainly not least, the Phoenix Mercury just keep getting scarier. After adding Diamond to Shields to an already stacked roster by trade earlier in the week, yesterday the team announced that they signed 2021's leading scorer, Tina Charles, who averaged over 23 points per game last year. You have to imagine that it's championship or bust for the Mercury this year, right? Well, that's all for today. For all the latest on your favorite Arizona sports teams, make sure to subscribe to gophnx.com and don't forget to follow us on Twitter, TikTok, and Instagram.